Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for rejoining me here in Old World Blues playing as the somewhat small but mighty Mojave chapter last time. We prepared very quickly for us to go to war with the Mojave Territories, which we are at war with them now. Uh, we got a couple comments to go through and a few, few things to adjust. So, yesterday, in the very first episode, we, or at least I, took the path of quickly going through these focuses to get to testing the bear. I did some of the math, and we could have probably actually done one of these longer routes to get even more civilian factories, or military factories, instead of doing two shorter focuses. Now, combined, these two focuses equal up to 120 days. If we did both of these routes, this one over here with the four focuses and four focuses over here, these are each 30 days. So 30 plus 30 plus 30 plus 30 times 2 is 240 days. So basically, if we wanted to do both long routes, it would take an extra 120 days. If not, you know, whatever. But we went by and did this really quickly. We probably could have done at least one long route. That's what I'm just trying to get at. Cool. Right now, we are currently doing advanced or power armor blueprints, which would be nice. As we are now at war, in which... We can do these focuses down here, emergency recruitment, you get 100 manpower, which, is, which isn't bad. Emergency materials, emergency production, and emergency ammunition, which, they're all okay. But regardless, we must now conduct business with wool, with the Mojave chapters. Or, not Mojave chapter, we are the Mojave chapter, with the Mojave territories. These guys want to move in, I'm going to tell them no. Because you guys are going to push, like crazy, in smashing these guys down here. And we're going to force the attack. Doesn't matter. Because right now we have 10% more attack plus 20% more attack. So we should do relatively okay over here. And once we do, we'll kill everyone up north and have a good time with them. Let's get some more decryption for decode signals. And then I asked you one question yesterday about which focus we should, we should do. The infantry actually beat the snot out of these guys. Okay. Why not? Why not? Why not? And I'll keep one of you guys here too. Nice. Very good, very good. And the Pursuant was annexed. Alright, well, whatever. I'm going to have... Ooh, let's see. I want the infantry to come down here, actually. Come down here. And just kind of hold the line. You guys, you all come this way. Except for you. You hold until we get the infantry over here. Beautiful. And the infantry are over there. Great! Only seven divisions of power armor. Truly, never enough. But the reason I went down the short focuses quickly, just in the early on, those short focuses, because I wanted to get here as fast as possible. There goes the divide now. Got to get these guys killed off as fast as possible so that we can take Hoover Dam. And you know what? We're at war right now. I'm going to start justifying on these guys. We do get a claim on Vault 3 later, but I'm just going to do it now just to get it over with so we can get them as fast as possible because even though it takes a while to justify on them, I think that'll be worth it. And honestly, if we're right here, we should see a bit of push out. Anyway, so I'm really not too worried about it. Ooh, I don't like that they have access over there. But if they come down, we'll kill them off. I have full confidence in our soldiers. For now. Cool. Someone did say that we could have instead built up land forts around Helios 1 to defend, defend, defend. Yeah, we could have. But I don't want to defend. I want to just push, 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 push. And do very, very well as best as we can. You're going to make an encirclement, and you're going to help do that, too. There you go. They should... Boom, they have it. They are, they don't have it yet, but... They just destroyed all the enemies. This preparation bonus is so OP. And actually, I did try it before. If we didn't have the preparation bonus, and, or we had a, a debuff to our preparation, we would actually not do that well. Because, for some reason, I think it might be a bug or something that you, like your soldiers can't reinforce or something like that. So, I don't know. This is why I wanted to try it with... Oh, sure, we can do that. Yeah, sure, why not? Uh, with what? Oh, man, my mind just blanked. I'm sorry. Uh, with extra preparation bonus. Because if you have a penalty to that, that's just not that's not good. That's no bueno, as some would say. You know what? Let's cut them off completely from their supplies. There you go. The one tile cut all these guys off from supplies for the most part. Decoded signals? Very good. Let's grab some encoded signals. Beautiful. You guys just go ahead and push up to here. You'll be fine. Push into here. You'll be great. And they're dead. Rough contesting set is now ours. Beautiful. You know what? At this point, just everyone go right on ahead. I don't think I gave orders to these folks. That's all right. Just go ahead. Let's see. Well, they have five to nine divisions left. They're about to capitulate. 
Of course, NCR is in the war with us, which is totally good. Totally fine to get. And the soldiers are captured up here, and they're going to die. You know, I'm going to tell the infantry, you guys come down here. Come down to Baker. Let the power armor deal with the soldiers. This way we, we lower our losses. Ooh. This is 60 days. This war will be over in 60 days. So instead... 100... I could get the more more political power. Time to begin recruiting the scribes. Everyone needs to help fight the NCR. I guess we could try that. I don't think we... We're going to win this war before 60 days. So really not too worried about it. Texas Brotherhood to clear war on Desperados. That's cool. Alright, well, they're dead. Biplane fighters. Oh, we got more soldiers down here too, though. Oh, boy. Triplane attackers, we could do that. It is 2276. Let's see. Anything here? Anything here? No, it's a little bit ahead of time. Anything over here? 200, 300 some days. That's a little bit too ahead for us. Now, let's get some healing powder, because that will probably be a pretty good thing. Alright, you guys have done a wondrous job. And I don't want to kill off my manpower as much as I don't have to, so you guys are going to stop the attack. Even though you are winning, because I want the power armor to do it. Let the power armor do it. Let them take the hits. Their armor probably won't get pierced. Oh, you won anyways. Cool. Let's see, manual prospectors. Oh, uh, sure, why not? Jurassic measures, nope. Ooh, stability, not looking too good right now. But is there someone better we could choose for staff, if needed? Supply consumption is probably the way we have to go for this. That will probably be very, very good. So stability and war support was not bad either. We're in well-equipped army. We can't even do every uh, cap for the army. It's just fine. Discourage traders. Mutant dipping pools. Caps expenses goes way down, but we get caps incomes goes way down as well. Centralized stockpiles. Oh. Huh. Okay, interesting. That's kind of different. Wasn't what I was expecting, but sure. Freeman's fixtures, entertainment, industrial concerns. That's not bad. Alex is one tool tool too but you know what I'm thinking let's get some more stability consumer goods we can lower research speed we're doing really well anyways doesn't really matter so they have what three divisions five to nine still oh they, I guess maybe they didn't die maybe they did they're almost dead anyway so it doesn't even matter and a little bit of lag uh, you don't need to go up that way guys oh, we went up that way anyways whatever doesn't matter you can use command power just kill them all off and let God sort them out wait it's not the campaign I don't think yeah, maybe they believe in God Maybe they do, maybe they don't. Individually, they, they might. Help them out down here. Look how weak they are, pathetic. Oh, Mojave chapters. Or Mojave territories. Why do I keep saying chapter? There you go, see? No problem. With that preparation bonus, we do fantastic. Of course, 30% more attack does help out quite a bit. So, a victory in Operation Sunburst. Today is a glorious day for the Brotherhood of Steel. Elder Elijah revealing his tactical prowess and his stunning defense of the Mojave chapter against a tyrannical NCR. We have managed to push the Republic soldiers to the Mojave outpost, although the question remains on whether we should continue this advance down the long 15 into California. If we were to try to assert dominance over this land, it's likely we would have to face a much more coordinated, coordinated response in return. Now, they are struggling over here, but I think we'll be okay. This is our land. We could do that. And when, in which the NCR does get an annex war goal against us, but let's not push this too far. I think if I play Mojave chapter again, I might choose this path, but that's pretty darn dangerous. And actually, we, we already yeah we already lost this, so we could own this again, but let's not push too far just because we're on historical. This is my first campaign with Mojave chapter and Old World Blue 3.0, and actually the less territory we have, the better it'll be for resistance for right now. So. We gotta use some riders or get some slave collars going. Because right now we're not doing great for slave collars, but that's okay. So like I said, I do want to kill off these guys. So, we shall have you guys come over here and train when needed. I'm glad actually the NCR took that territory because we don't really need it. Cool, if that's the case, I get political power back if I cancel it. And, so with that done, victory at Sunburst. To others, this victory may have been seen as the impossible. They were fools. My victory here was always a certainty. We get stability and war support, which is awesome. Uh, Elijah loses his distrusted elder, and daily intellectual support, minus 0 0.05, and people get more skill. Great! And which we will talk about the focuses after this, which I asked you guys about yesterday. We're actually building some civilian factories. Go figure. And at what point can we not do this anymore? Less than 80% of stability. That's fine. Ooh, if that's the case, we're going to get 20% more. So that means we should probably do this now so we can maximize our stability. Let's go and do that. Maximize it. Uh, nine caps. Almost ten caps. That's fine. Resistance. Do we not have enough guns? No, we got plenty of guns. Manpower is fine, too. Oh. Hmm. Ah. Oh, I see. 
There we go. We duplicated that. Yes, we did. Ooh, anyone else here? Spec Ops? No, we're not going to use that. We have more than 10 army XP. There you go. Good. Less manpower needed for this. There we go. Hey, we've got like what, 200 more manpower. Not bad. Uh, we're suffering. Oh, we are suffering some sort of attrition here. That is not ideal. Oh, well, they're exercising. That's what. Okay, I'm like, ooh, I don't like that. I don't like attrition. I really hate attrition. Ooh, don't get me wrong. But we do have a cup of coffee here to keep us nice, warm, and alert. For a while, at least. Until the drug called caffeine wears off. Uh, what else do we want? Eh, I guess we do try plane injectors, because I want them eventually. Might as well research them, right? Three, five is good for now. Keep it on three. I think we'll be okay. I will upgrade these other power armor units later on. 58 is not bad. One a day is not too bad, actually. 70%. I could lower my war support, but that'd be kind of foolish to lower it. Hmm. Good. More infantry, even though I really don't want to make too much infantry. We will need some. I'm treating it just like robots for power armor. So, like, whenever I play with robots, I always like to keep some degree of infantry just in case uh, robots don't do well. And obviously, we need more regular battalions to support a bigger army of power armor. So, of course, you can only have so much with, until the caps start eating into your cost, which is not very bueno, but whatever. Whatever. Repair the next turbine. Oh, wait, there's a way we can see this. Yeah, if you open up... The, yeah, you actually see this active. Active. Disabled. We get plus 56 energy. That's not enough energy. Uh, it's only 0.8. How many caps do we have? 152? We're losing some consumer goods, but so be it. Military signing bonuses. We get more weekly manpower. That's not bad. Lux tax on luxury goods. That might not be bad. 7% though. It's okay. It's okay. Political bribes. I mean, we could do that if we want to hire some more guys around here. But I think we're doing pretty well, actually. So, I'm assigned divisions. Yes. Ooh, that means we're down there. That's fine. I do want to have a bigger army for now, because we will go to war eventually with New Vegas, and I do want to take them out. We're going to get 1.5 political power a day. Not bad. And victory at Sunburst. That's a lot of stability. That's a lot of war support. So, I asked you guys yesterday whether we should do Establish Helio Citadel, Neck of the Colorado, or Fortify Hidden Valley. And I'll be honest with you guys here. There's almost no support for Hidden Valley. At the time of this recording. There might be later on, but there's not that much support for Hidden Valley, which makes sense. Now, there's there's a, a lot of support for both Establish Helios 1 or doing Neck of the Colorado. However, at the time of this recording, there's more support for bum -ba -da -bum, Neck of the Colorado. So that's the way we move our capital to Hoover Dam, which would put us in a pretty tough conflict with the Legion if they were to take out our capital. So this is the one that you guys selected overall the time it's recording with more support. With our chapter no longer having to hide at Helios, it's time to I guide the Brotherhood and show them where to establish their new base of operations. The Hoover Dam was always what I wanted out of the Mojave, and it's what I will get. The Brotherhood will base their operations there. We move our capital, we get 5,000 more manpower, or at least the state does. Massively fortify the state, more energy, and additional turbine inside the Hoover Dam is brought online, increasing power output. So whenever I play as Mojave chapter again, Please remind me to, hopefully, hopefully, go down one long route at least, and I can still do one short route, but at least one long route, as well as not choosing Veronica Santangia, Santan Veronica S. If I play as Mojave Chapter again someday, please remind me that I should probably go down that lucky old son, as well as 10, to your business, just to keep it a little bit different. And then, of course, not to choose the neck of Colorado in the future, but we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. In which, then we will be doing... Integrating the Mojave, which would be great. Love it, love it, love it. So we might want to start building up our reserve of political power right now. This coffee is not too bad. Do we need more water, actually? The executives are gone. No, we have, oh, we got plenty of water. Once we have Hoover Dam. Oh, yeah, we got plenty of water. Because last time, I think we needed some water for, like, power armor and stuff. So, 10 political power for medical tech. That's not bad. Clay working, that's pretty good. Forty engineering. You know what? Let's grab some vacuum tubes now. Research speed is key. I think we do get a sixth research slot later on as well. Cowboy country was annexed. Very nice. 
Ah, uh, border skirmish at the dam. Oh no. It seems that after our recent victory at Helios, our paladins may have got a bit overzealous. As Elijah made their way to the dam, of which the NCR denied them access to so foolishly, they learned that there was a skirmish there between the Brotherhood and the eastern slaver horde known as Kaisa's Legion. Our paladins seem to have no experience fighting such strange foes, their strategy mixing elements of tribal, wastelander, and ancient tactics in a terrifying fashion. It seems we have some training to do if we are to stand up to such a threat. Ooh, we have some training to do. We lose war support and 400 manpower, legion, tactical, and experience. Oh my goodness. We can improve our tactics against the legion through training. Done from a decision unlocked by the focus preparing against legion. Um, That is not bueno. I do not want to lose that. So I'm not clicking on that. Mm -mm. Can't force me. Can't force me. No, no, no. So we got 100 political power now. Yeah, supply consumption is the way we gotta go. I wanna build up factories faster. Coring stuff shouldn't take too long. And actually, how, how far along are we with coring stuff? Occupied territories. Oh, 69. Nice. Very nice. 22%. We still got a little bit of time. So let's go ahead and grab you over here so we can get slightly faster civilian construction speed. Even though I do want to get. What am I? Voice change. Uh, nightly armaments. That'd be very good. So, scavengers found something in the ruins of an ancient factory. Our scavengers found pre war goods. This time will tell whether it was worth the blood and it's what we paid for it. Uh, not really. <laughs> Naval AA attack, plus 10% for six months. That, I can't say that's really going to help us that much. Just saying. So we got this, which would be good to throw on our guys. We should probably get some trained mongrels as well. We got some automation. Land auction is nice. We got to do specialized warfare. I don't want to do this too late. I want to make sure that our special forces, special armor, power armor, is very special. Cool. And we're halfway done with this, which is good. Ooh, actually, I, he's an isolationist, and he, we no longer lose intellectual support, which is good. Ooh, that manpower, though. Ooh, why do you hurt me so much, game? Why? Speaking of resources, we could do this one. Resource production, we might as well. Resource efficiency gain and energy sale gain per energy, might as well. Even though I don't think, as long as we hold the dam, we'll have plenty of resources for a while. And actually, Hoover Dam itself... It has one outpost. Of course, this is before we actually core it, which is a colony state. We get 2% of the state's manpower, and on top of that, it will get the following modifiers because of its occupation status. Oh, well, that's kind of raining over there. Radio, a radiation storm, huh? Cool. Anything over here? Nope. We want to do the next focus on integrating the Mojave. Now that we have conquered the Mojave, I need to ensure that the NCR can't simply come back here. I need to make it mine. So we get one, two, three, six states or provinces in which we get a permanent local 25% reduction in coring costs. Which is kind of nice, not gonna lie, that's kind of nice. And then to the Great Beyond down here. Oh wait, we can actually core this stuff? To the Great Beyond? That's... N I did not realize that. Nipton and Good Springs becomes a core. Oh, we get three more cores right there too. I thought we'd actually have to use political power to core it. If that's a case, then no, I don't think I will spend my political power. So how many states do we have? We have Route 95. We've got Hoover Dam, of course. We have Boulder City, basically. Oh, yeah, our tanks also, it's about power armor, have power armor has anti-tank on them. Cottonwood Cove, of course. We have Nipton and Good Springs. One, two, three, f one, two, three, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Controlling Nipton through fear. Less resistance target. Uh, to the Great Beyond. Yeah, what? You might as well just core this as fast as you possibly can. Black Mountain Trap. Expand that 188. Boulder City gets more development. And Oh, Conwood Cove, Route 95, and Boulder City become now cores. Yeah, there's literally no point saving up political power for then for the core stuff. Post Sunburst Helios Research. Ooh. Nice. Very nice. Next up, we have 100% stability. And send some power armor to scavenge stuff. We could I'll help these guys out first. Let's try. Why? Not? Excuse me. Why not? Why not? Like the Pokemon. Uh, our plane bombers. That's not worth it. Not worth it at all. That stuff is coming along. Vehicles. We could do that. Ah, some doggos. We love the doggos. Who does not? Triplane attackers. Cool. I'm gonna put you under all this other stuff. Yeah, triplane attackers are nice. But as long as we got some biplane fighters, I think we should be relatively okay. Uh, resource efficiency game, we'll be okay without it for now. Since we're going to be a little bit ahead of time, let's get some more defense for military training. I think that'd be fine. Totally fine with me. Alright, more political power, right? 
Surveyor. You might as well grab them now. Get more construction speed. We gotta build things faster. After that, we'll just do the Great Beyond. Hunt for the stars. Yeah, I don't want to hurt my consumer goods factories right now, but to the Great Beyond. Veronica, for some reason, is insisting that I actually go through and try to help these groups with the Brotherhood's resources. While a purely humanitarian effort would be a waste of my time, no reason I can't find some useful information in the interim. The ghouls traveling to the Great Beyond actually have a fair knowledge of Revcon rocket systems. Perhaps I can share that information when we need them. So we lose some 15% research speed, but... At this point, research... It's important, and we, we still need to do it. But research is... Okay, and we lose 15% for a year. That's actually a long time. But if I get two cores, and we have to spend manpower, equipment, to garrison, or put down resistance, in my book, that's just, that's worth it. That's really worth it, so. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. You guys go ahead and core. We got 13 army XP. Militia training, militia force. Am I, did I convert my guys to all those? No, what do you got? Oh, you guys are infantry. You're 10 combat with infantry. That's right. Uh, I don't mind making these guys 20 combat with, because 10, 10 combat with probably isn't going to stand up to a lot. How much power armor do we have? You know what? Let's do this instead. Uh, Peach you out anyways, and stop making you. Because we're going to make you instead. Cool. Let's see. You. One, one, two, three, four. Convert these guys over. Make them 20 combat with immediately. Oh, we can't do that. Oh, man. That sucks. Can I convert two? Yes, we can. Nice. There we go. Easy. Actually, you know what? Don't even make any more power armor, then. Because we can't afford that many divisions to be 20 combo with yet. Yet. We can make you do that as well. If that's the case, make these guys 20 combo with. We're going to be running out of manpower very soon, but so be it. We're going to get some cores anyways. Specialized warfare, vacuum tubes. You know what? Just do one at a time. Save some manpower just in case. Just in case. Let's grab some of this heavy trooper power. Heavy Trooper Mountaineering Tactics, very good. And let's grab some Heavy Trooper Open Area Tactics. Also very good. We're going to maximize this out as fast as possible. Or close to that. We could do that. We're currently at 14. Do we really need to do that anymore? Gator Maws, huh? I don't want to see my army. I just want to see the tile. I just want to see my capital. There we go. Hey, we got three. 121. I think we're okay. I really think we're okay without doing it again for now. So, let's see. More political power. Brother armaments. More liability. Yeah. I, I, I kind of have to do that. We kind of have to do that. We get more speed, which is nice, but still. Let's see. We still have enough power armor. Awesome. That's really awesome. Hit and run. Are we supposed to do the power armor or with our cars? Uh, let's see. Walking tanks. Oh, yes. More breakthrough. More soft attack. More heart attack. And more defense for the entire army. Yes, please. Fort Mall was annexed. Boom. I'm glad we didn't have to wait too long. Because we're going to go to war pretty much immediately. And these guys are just going to steamroll the enemies. So this way we can core Vault 3 faster. Instead of just waiting for our focuses. Because in the focus, eventually we do the Jewel of Mojave and we get a claim for Vault 3. However, how schematic to get Robco Industries, working with Benny, which is okay, scavenge Vault 21. And you can either do Steward of Vegas which you get plus 25% planning speed, or enlist the families. Now, I want your opinion. It seems like Steward of Vegas probably is better because you get more planning speed. You do basically get a free core on New Vegas and five civilian workshops. What do you think? I I'm pulling for Steward of Vegas. I think that's probably the way to go once you own New Vegas, of course. But it seems like Steward of Vegas is probably the better way to go. But, hmm... I guess someone could say you could do this one just because it could cost 300 political power to core New Vegas. So, that might be better in the short term if you need political power, but what are your thoughts? Should we do Enlist the Families or Steward of Vegas? Regardless, it's time to commit atrocities? No, it's time to commit uh, actions. We'll call it, They'll call them suitable actions against the fiends, which I have to do this, unfortunately, because when I try to click on this, I get selected my soldiers. Fiends, hello, fiends. Goodbye, fiends. You know what, for funsies, we're just going to force attack. We've lost no guys versus 52. Well, they died. Thank you for playing. We probably lost more, more, like, equipment than manpower. Of course, if you lose more than zero, then yes. Mm -hmm. 
Happy 2277, everyone. Hope you're having a great, great year. Let's go and grab some more output now. Let's get some more construction. We want to build, 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 build. So you guys can hold here. It's going to be kind of weak. And I'm glad we have anti-tank. And I'm going to have you guys concentrate around here. Because we will go to war with Vegas. How strong is New Vegas, by the way? Oh, there they go. Very good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Economic miracle. They have a non-aggression pack. They have only a thousand man power. Seven? Oh, we could go to war with them now. Oh, I want to go to war with them now. Scavenger turn triumphant. You can read this if you want to. This happens every time, so. That's new world hopes. Oh, I want to go to war with them right now. I really, really do. How long would it take to ju just fight? I mean, we have a focus to go against them. Ooh, 30, 180 days. Will it take 180 days to get down there? I see that's 60. 60. And to do this, you gotta do this. So. Screw it. We already have anti-tank. We can probably pierce them anyways, right? Hmm. Yeah, robots with logistics. Cool. To the great beyond. Hunt the stars for the seekers. Admittedly, the devotion that these star seekers have to finding Festus's treasure is impressive. Let's send a few scouts out and follow them if they see if they, any of them ever actually uncover something of importance for the Brotherhood. We lose consumer goods factories, but you know what? I don't really care as long as we get more manpower and cores. Free cores I will gladly take. Let's see. Mojave Raiders. Territories, Cottonwood Cove. So, what was that? I can't remember. Ah, oh, Cottonwood Cove. Let's do them quite bueno. Well, hmm. Occupied states. Ah, Nipton is our core. Love it. Good Springs is also our core. Love it. And in the end, though, I do want to make sure that we get enough uh, infrastructure built around here, too. So, Oh, we don't even have that much infrastructure in Hoover Dam. Well, we get a lot more resources that way. Less than a thousand manpower, which is a little alarming. A little bit of alarm. But, setting up mana prospectors, maybe. We can only get five people a month. Wow, that's not good. Yeah, we must well go to war now. We gotta go to war now before Vegas gets too strong and it'd be difficult to take them out. It's gonna ruin our manpower, but in the long run, I think we'll I think we'll do okay. We should do okay. You know, they do have quite a few robots, which I don't like, but we have a few planes, you know, here and there. Of course, it, there is an argument to be made. If we wait to take out Vegas later, they'll probably have built up more forts, or at least more factories, so this way when we do take them out later, they'll have more things built, but where we're headed, well, we'll probably find enough factories where, where we really want them, so. Man, that manpower. Pacification, um... Hmm. Sporadic outposts. Minus. We can drop it a little bit. Oh, Sundog, cool. Strength 4.8, 4.7, that's good. It's getting lower and lower, which is awesome. Hey, there we go, save a little bit more. We definitely, 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 definitely need more crowd control here. Hey, we got make, oh, we're making some triplane attackers too, nice. Make some of that, that'll be good. Doggos, make that above. Eh, keep one line going on for now. We have 20 biplane fighters, not bad. We, m I think I'm going to save some political power up. 135 political power is not bad. Paladin Tide helps us out with that, which is good. I'll probably raise my conscription level 2% more. That'd be good. Hunt the stars for the Seekers. And the Black Mountain Trap. Surprisingly, keeping Utobithia around and allowing them to continue their broadcast is very useful. It effectively acts as a lure, bringing super mutants out of hiding into our territory, from there allowing us to gun them down and keep their numbers low. Wow. Okay. Yeah, why not? Hmm. Weekly manpower. This one just looks a little better and better. How much money do we have? 161. Eh. Oh, new systems care package would not be bad. More daily compliance could be pretty good. Let's go with military signing bonuses because we get like 500 more manpower. Let's do that one. We could use that. We could actually really, really use that. Let's see. Oh, we can already do this. You know what? More training to Actually, it's less training time if we go down this way. Same amount of organization. 2% more recruitable population. Lose 2% stability, which is fine. 1% less. Oh. Oh, crap. 1% less what? Well, we actually get 1% more war support. We lose 1% attack defense, and research speed remains the same. And less special forces cap multiplier, which kind of sucks. But we need the population. The Legion musters. The cosplayers to the east are preparing to storm the dam. We've been caught flat-footed and already bloodied from our war against NCR, but let them find out why we were the masters of, Mar New of Mariposa. We must hold the dam to the... 
class? Oh, are, 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 are you guys gonna do, like, a raid? Because the Legion can do slave raids, but... Okay. Can't see if they want to build bandits? Cool! Uh, what? I was not expecting this. So, let's not lose our capital just yet. That would probably be pretty bad. And I'm glad we're not at war with anyone else right now, because this is a little bit unexpected. Scribes, paladins, knights, relics of a past and a future. Oh, there we go. Uh, against them stands a legion who will act like a bull in the china shop through all the brotherhood values if they get their way. Who will win? A damn technology must be preserved. Move, please, for love of God, move quickly. Okay, so we're here. Do, is this supposed to be a normal war, or... Because I'm, I'm, I'm not moving out. I'm staying here. They're not going to push us out. No. Let's grab some Special Forces expansion. That'd be good. I'm not moving out, because we can't afford to take on too much more uh, non-core territory, we will say. Air stuff. Close air support range. Might as well. Well, guys, you want to attack the dam? Oh, crap. Get in there. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Ah, there we go. And immediately start attacking. They should hold. They're fine. I really wish I could see how look, how many forts we have there. Oh, my goodness. They're attacking with a lot of guys. They can't pierce us, though. So, not too worried about that, then. And we can cycle soldiers. Recycle, cycle, whatever you want to call it. I'm glad I mobilized more soldiers, though. That's good. Hopefully, we get a white piece with them later on. We still have plenty of days left, so... And since they're attacking over the Colorado River here, this is the Colorado River, right? The Gila Estuary. We should do okay. How are they at 42 already? They can't pierce us. McNamara should do relatively okay as well. Ah, uh, Veronica. Leading the other two generals. 42, 86. Losses thus far? We've lost 16, which is not good. I'm glad we're mobilizing. And about 500-ish. Death Clause 8 team. Ooh, that sucks. That really not bueno. Oh, well. What can we do? But hey, at least this is basically free experience for our soldiers. And you know what? How much support equipment do we have? 68. That's not great. But it's going to have to do for now. Cam companies. We don't have enough. That sucks. So, get some more support equipment then. Provide power, armor to scavengers. Sure, why not? Oh, we're, we are at war, so we got more war support, which is good. We could also get some more stability. Ah, oh, the Black Mountain Trap. Very nice. Elijah's Ambition. We can't do this because we need to do that that lucky old son. So I guess we can core some of those places. Yeah, that sucks. I should really read these focuses a little bit more. Tend your business. Yeah, that lucky old son. Offer. Yeah. Hmm. Big sadness. So we might actually have to manually core some stuff. That's fine. But let's get into the research slot because we can. Elijah's Ambition. This is my moment. My chance to gain what I've always deserved. I was about to sing this is my moment, but I would have really done that really poorly. Harden falls ill. So be it. Metalworking. Not bad. Public projects? Why not? Yeah, I didn't want to start singing there and make it really, really bad. Oh, crap. Are they naval invading? That's not good. That's a few too many soldiers. There you go. Go back. We only need really two, probably, to deal with, deal with enemies. And Simon Caldwell. Oh, he's a bunker kid. But then again, so is everyone else, so. Go ahead and retreat. That is not good. That is not good. Oh, crap. 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 Oh, I'm glad we moved our capital, though. That's good. Yeah, no, you're gonna die here. Oh, they invaded down here, too. Pulling soldiers out of there is fine. Force the attack. Force it. Kill them off. Kill them, kill them, kill them, kill them, kill them. You guys gotta hold, son. I was not expecting them to naval invade me. Holy cow. But, alas, they did. And I killed them off. Oh, inspirational. That actually makes up for your bunker kit experience. So, you earn a normal amount of XP. So there's, there's got to be a, a white piece later on, right, between us. Right? 60 versus 2,000? Because, I mean, we can kill off the Legion. It's going to take quite a bit of time, and probably a little bit of me playing off-screen, just so that we can get through this. Uh, but, still. I'm going to leave you right there. I'm going to leave you r right over there as well. I'm not going to put him back in the army, but he'll be there just in case. Because, can they pierce us? No. Actually, do we have planes around here? Ooh, I'm glad we took Vault 3 so we have the airbase over there. Unless that's just Camp McCarran. Maybe it is. I don't know. Enemy planes? Maybe, maybe not. 
Walking tanks are nice. Let's go ahead and do principal. Army gets more recon. It's only 0.2 more, but that's okay. Defense, hardness, soft attack. Ugh. And soft attack, hard and soft attack. Infantry does better as well, which I like. Champions of Virtue, which I do like quite a bit. Or Purity. Really, I probably only would choose Purity for if I was playing as the Enclave. Hmm, yeah. Resistance, growth, speed. Minus 25% is not bad, but less reinforce rate. Shock and awe is not bad either. Well, we're going to go with Principle. I think that makes more sense for us. Purity, well, we're as pure as we can be for now. Hey, oh wow. 50, huh? They actually have enemy gliders. Go figure. I'm glad we mobilized too. Ooh, are we suffering any supply issues right now? No, nope, that's good. That's very good. So if that's the case, we're going to have to sort of start coring some of these places manually, which is totally, totally fine. Actually, if we core this, we actually get more defense. Oh, we already have the cord. Do we already have all these other places cord? Hold on. What is not cord? Oh, just Vault 3. Oh. Sweet. And we need 104 political power to core that area. Not bad. Construction-wise, let's, let's keep building ourselves up here. That'd be kind of good. Kind of good. Wait, we have one power armor. Come to Boulder City, just in case. Well, we've only killed off 3,000 of them. Almost 4,000. There's got to be a white piece here somewhere eventually, right? Right? Uh, fathers demand demilitarization. Son, what are you talking about? Do you not see that we are literally fighting against a slaving cohort known as a legion? They are well known throughout this area. Y'all bunch of crazies, if you think, that we just gonna roll over and die. 7,500? I mean, they could eventually break our lines and kill off all our manpower, but... How much? How strong are they? Because they will go to war with other people. N NP restoration... Eh. Eh. Monoplane fires. We could do that. Industry... Let's get some primitive radios. Yeah, I really was not expecting to go to war with these guys. Yeah, we can't go to war with New Vegas then. God dang it. So sad. I'm thinking about doing this too. Wasteland survival training so we get some better justify war goals times as well as division organization, which would be very nice. Just a stand. We can't do that yet. It's fine. 64. Da, da, da. Oh, I just, oh, crap. They landed again. Jewel Mojave. We could do that by now. Repcon development. Scribe research. Robotics. Study Prim Slim. I like that one. Chasing Dell's Brigade. Preparing against the Legion. Training against Legion tactics. We begin efforts to train our army in the art of fighting against the Legion and preparation against a future attack from them. It's extremely important. When it comes to fighting the Legion, if we are not prepared against them, they are likely to overwhelm us completely. It is advisable to begin training against the Legion as soon as possible. Sacker Expedition. Eh, I guess we might as well, right? Idiots! Idiots, all of them! These paladins can't even fight faux classical age soldiers. They have a 2,000 year technological and tactical advantage over them. This shouldn't be happening. Everyone needs to prepare for the Legion. We can't be made fools again. Fools of again. I mean, I think we're doing kind of okay right now, aren't we? Oh, wait. Oh, you left. I'll, I'll leave you guys out then. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not going to be too harsh against them. They're just doing the best they can for now. Mm. Get some additional plating. Why not? Nice. And you guys come down here just in case. One division... You know what? You both come here then. Did they, they did invade down here again. Wow. Simon, you got anything for us? You're level 3. Survivalist. I might do Life Giver. I like this one. I like Animal Friend, but I think Life Giver is better so we lose less men. Which shouldn't be too much, so. Wow, that number is going crazy right there. Alright, Legion. How many more men? Gira's Conviction? Cool. Well, good luck with that. Presidente? Very good luck. Very good luck. How's this uh, Vault 3 looking? If the Legion didn't go to war with us, we would have, we would do very well against Vegas. Ah, but dreams are crushed, hope was abandoned, and that's okay. Until, of course, the NCR wants to kill us off too, which would happen. Hmm. Hmm. No matter. No matter. We'll do fine. I hope. Cass. Uh, we could use that. Decorated hero. Stability war support. Research speed is not bad. It's really not that bad. Hmm, and we were just holding out very finely. No undesirables, petty criminal conscripts, power armor, power armor scavengers attacked. How can raiders field power armor? That's sad. Slave conscripts, meh. Slaves, 
Reduces slave capture multiplier by two, which I'm not really too concerned about. We can't do this, which is weird, because we need 60% world tension. Very odd. Oh, we actually made another division. Go figure. So, how many of Kaiza's soldiers am I supposed to kill off before they give up? No, that's not really worth it. That's not really worth it either. Either? Either. We could send out some manual prospectors, but uh, I don't feel like it right now. Oh, PO4 truth. Standing against the east. Okay, cool. There isn't many of us. Each who goes down smashed by a power fist or machete shot with a crude half rifles is one irreplaceable life. Yet we stand all the same. The eastern wave will break against a rock just as so many have against the Hoover Dam. Gets the event. Brotherhood Mojave Brotherhood offers a white piece. Is it really a white piece or is it a white piece where we just kind of like, hey, yo, let's chill out. Y'all can't break us. Come back again another day. At this point, god dang it, the amount of time we had to spend defending these guys, Vegas is looking a little thicker, which was not good. If anything, I'd probably try to break through here first and circle and destroy those divisions. Oh, but look at that army. Eric's be holy cow. Now that is nice. We are way out of fighters, though. Holy cow. Unfortunately, we're going to have to hold. And we're going to lose air superiority, or at least air combat ability. Sucks. Oh, well. Let's see. Recon. We already have a slight amount of recon. Maintenance, dynamite. We can also grab some dynamite. Making some up there. Making some over here. And how many pieces of equipment do they use? 100. And we have about 100. We can probably use them here. Alright. Preparing against the Legion. Cool. Fortifying the dam. I guess right now we might as well, right? The dam is heavily, a heavily defensible location. I'll have McNamara fortify it for me and manage the defenses against the Legion proper. No. We're doing Jewel, Jewel of the Mojave so that we get our war goal and we can go to war whenever we need to against New Vegas. It's a wonder that House lived as long as he did. I am not a superstitious man, but he got lucky. It's time my soldiers take a vacation to Vegas. Enjoy the nightlife of the city of sin before they bring in a, bag, a management shift. No monopoly rules forever, after all. So we still got some time before we can do that. Guys, please try to come on in. Please try to nail invade me again. I wonder if they will get the option to offer a white piece. Oh my goodness. Inspiration would be pretty good to do. Ooh, we could use Cunning Leader, which is eh. Beloved Leader, which is eh. Savage Leader, yes. Veronica. Power Armor Attack. Rooted. I'm going to go with Rooted. We could do Pain Train, but this applies to more of our soldiers anyways. In which we should get Savage Leader. So that will be good. Once she gets to level 3. It's all level 2 though. Huh. Hey, look. I knew I put you guys here for a reason. Actually, I should have let them come in first. You know what? Come on in. Now kill them. Beautiful. Oh, what are we missing? What are we missing? Oh, infantry armor. Uh, how much? Do we really need that much for this group? Huh? Eh, well, that's alright. Oh, hello. Oh, you're actually spreading out. That's not good. Yeah, I'm taking Nip Tim back. They might break us down there, but we've only killed off 10,000 of them. <laughs> we've lost us in 200, so... Where's the attack? Public projects, very good. Let's grab... Can we grab this? No, we cannot. Some crop rotation. Nearly 200 political power. I just want to core this area, man. That's all I want to do, just core this. That's all. How many more dead legionnaires do we have to get rid of? Or kill kill off? They have less than 1,000 manpower. They're definitely going to be putting these guys in a hole. <clears throat> As long as no one else goes to war with me. If that happens, then we gotta just defend Helios 1 like crazy. Good job, guys. I'm gonna put you guys right there just in case, and put you guys back here just in case you need to defend this area as well. I really don't know if the Legion gets an event to wipe peace out with us. We got 21 caps, not bad. Recon infiltration. Oh, that's gonna help our army out so much. Warrior code, might as well. We lose some pop recruitable population factor, but whatever. Does no one else really have. Experience? Level 4, 3, 3, 2. Come on, guys. Appeal for a truce. I don't really care about the truce. Oh, training gets the Legion tactics. The Legion fights unlike any other group the Brotherhood has faced in recent years. Fanatical, insane, ruthless. They are closer to beasts than man. We need to resolve our spirit and train our paladins in the art of fighting such monsters. For 20 days, Legion tactical and experience with Legion Brotherhood Legion preparation. Uh, sure. Looking for stars, helping the brights launch. Okay, attack against country. Oh, we even have—we actually lost attack and defense. Oh, I didn't realize that. 
You know, since we're waiting, let's go into reconnaissance. Yeah, I'm gonna go and grab a supply because fighting the wasteland is gonna be really god awful in some areas. So, tolerate settle automation. Well, that's cool. Good job. Pain your office annex, and they're out of manpower. Oh, we've killed off all of the legion's manpower. I mean, how many? They have like 80 divisions, right? So they're not looking too good now, especially those special forces. The special forces are not very special. Los was puppeted, and the good navy invade us again. Jewel the Mojave. Where to find the damn? We could do that rewarding veterans of the Legion campaign. Uh, we need to own Vegas. We could get more power armor, I suppose. Let's fortify the dam because we can. The dam is a heavily defensible location. I'll have McNamara fortify it for me and manage the defenses against the Legion proper. And I want to do this one too. Rumors of the Sierra Madre, huh? Eventually. Hello, three divisions. Three special forces divisions. You're about to die. Actually, you know what? They can each do them individually. I think we'll do okay once they start losing some serious amount of men. Monoplane fighters, you might as well. How many more must we kill off? I wonder, at this point, I know it would be really bad for, like, supply, resistance, manpower, equipment. Could we actually, like, like kill off all their enemies? Kill off all the divisions here? And just take over the entire chapter? Chapter? L entire legion? I think that'd be kind of cool. Prim prim primitive radio? Not bad. Symbol circuitry next? I'm so ready to record this. 76.8, 76.7, or just 0.7.2. Yeah, uh, no, oh, because we don't have... Hmm, yeah, we don't have a special one. That's alright. Come over here, we're doing that. And I'm going to grab this one too. Radio's pretty good to do. Love the radio. I really don't want to be the one to have to call for a piece. Oh, help settlements out. Su support equipment, how are we doing on that? We're not making any more, but we got plenty enough for now. Dogs are looking pretty good. Infantry equipment looking great. Power armor looking great. Love it. Oh, Harden, you got an upgrade? Oh, it's a cunning desert fox. You are commanding infantry for now. Let's get some more recon. How many more slots do you have? Oh, yeah, ninja. Cunning desert fox. That would work very well for us. Oh, a little bit of lag. Cool. Ah, McNamara. Level 4 now. Strong back. Those guys, those straights are not that great. You guys have done well. And Veronica, anything else? No, you do not. Ah, another division. Don't mind if we do. I could upgrade. Wow, look at how look how weak these enemy soldiers are. These guys are veterans. You guys, you are not. So I'm going to convert you to this if we can. Thank you. You're only half strength, but that's totally fine. Half these guys are only 10 combat with, so. I mean, we've killed off 16,000 guys. Ooh, when is, does this expire? No, it does not, which is awesome. Cool. Oh, this one? Yeah, might as well, right? Appeal for a truce. Repair the next thing, Emo Bob. Use this in care package. Fortifying the dam. I and mean, we can fortify it more. They might stop attacking us. I mean, we could probably push into them right now. I really don't want to have to get a truce with these guys. Acclimatization training. Let's go ahead and grab some more soft attack with Marksmanship Doctrine. And we'll do one more focus before we end the episode. Sounds like someone's trying to enable invade me again. Please keep it up. Please, please, please. Backyard workshops don't mind if we do. Oh, let them in. Let them in. There they are. Uh, hey, there they are. Seriously, how many men have we killed off? Helping the Brights launch. Hey, you got 15% more research speed. Very nice. And let us conclude today's episode with Midnight Science Fiction Theater. Cool, why not? Suspense, comedy, science, all this and more tonight at the Mojave Drive-In. We have heard some reports of oddities near the Mojave Drive-In. Perhaps I should send a scout team, which only takes 30 days to do, which is awesome. But I think we'll end today's episode here. We've done really, really well. I was not expecting going to war with the Brotherhood, or Brotherhood, the Legion. But regardless, we are, and we've only killed off a good number of them, including 17,000, almost 18,000. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you, But I do have a question. Should I do... Appeal for a truce. That's probably what we should do. We've killed off a lot of them. But regardless, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow. When we might be at peace with the Legion, and maybe take out New Vegas. Who knows? Regardless, I didn't know that the Brotherhood owned Navarro. And I hope you have a great, great rest of your day.